All right, y'all. So busy times with the homestead and farm here. Anyway, I uh, cut hay yesterday and uh, was cutting some more today after I got home from work. And anyway, going back to yesterday, my dad come down and used uh, my tractor and the hay mower and I was using my father-in-law so we were running two at a time and then uh, my red tractor broke down I was kind of expecting the hay mower too but not the tractor but anyway so is life but didn't have time to get to it yesterday um, coming back to today after I got home from work I cut for a couple of hours and then I had to run help my buddy uh, haul a horse for somebody because he was hauling something else and couldn't make it back in time and after I got back I just got my tractor going and I am unhooking the hay mower here because I got the tractor going I pulled the lever to let the hay mower up so I could take it back home and a hydraulic hose busted so I'm gonna have to take that off tomorrow and get that fixed so I can bring the hay mower back home and all that fun stuff but so is life right especially with homestead stuff farm whatever you want to call it anyway I've been uh, taking some video clips doing the uh, hay, so hopefully I'll be able to put a video together after it's said and done with here, and hopefully y'all enjoy. So, my phone looks weird. I don't think it's on the sideways angle, but. It may be, uh, this video may be all wipes out it, so I apologize for that, but I'm going to get this unhooked and try to get the, oh, the tractor breakdown was just, uh, where it still has trash in the tank. It's gotten over there and stopped the, uh, spout up in the bottom where the fuel comes out, so I had to take the line loose and blow through it with air compressor. It's not a total fix, but temporary. Because I really don't want to have to take that tank all the way off. After it uh, gets real low again, I'll probably go ahead and take the drain out the bottom again and try to drain as much air as possible. But other than that, it is what it is at the moment. So that's all I got for this one. Stay prayed up, prepped up, and strapped up. See ya.